They get the snap off. Rodgers rifles one along the hash marks, and he's got a first down to Austin William. Just to throw. And the end zone. Touchdown. Makai Polk. Just what Mississippi State needed with a buck 55 to go before halftime. And it's really the motion that helps set this one up. You're going to see Polk on the outside. The motion takes that safety out of the way. So now he's working one on one on the outside with no. Wobbles the snap, maintains his composure, and goes down. There's the first big impact play made by the Mississippi State defense. 15 of 19 for 205 yards, not too bad. Back shoulder throw, a little push off, and Malik Heath executed it perfectly. Mississippi State. There goes Woody Marks in motion. A slant at the goal line, reaching back. Jameer Calvin holds on for the touchdown. And that is a heck of a catch, because that ball on the back shoulder, Rodgers had pressure in his face, so wasn't able to get that out in front of the receiver, but a great. Rodgers looked at his check down. Now he's looking at the end zone, dumps it off, front pylon, Dylan Johnson, he's got a Mississippi State touchdown. What did Mike Leach say early on? Just execute, they can't stop us. But look at it. It's blocked. Mississippi State blocks the field goal and keeps it a five-point game. Rodgers in the end zone. Makai Polk has given Mississippi State the lead. This is the exact same play the last touchdown Makai Polk caught. They motion the outside receiver in. They run it again, and again, nothing there for Bigsby. Lost the football, and Bo Nix, it looks like, jumped on top of it. Rodgers at the goal line. Mississippi State touchdown. Two. Rodgers takes the snap into the end zone. Touchdown to Malik Heath. It's not even a slant. That's just an angle route. He's just beating leverage, getting inside quickly, and using his frame. Four-man rush. And he's backing up. And now lost the football. Did he get it back? Mississippi State thinks they have it, and they do. Randy Charlton gets the strip set. As that will be the game's final play, what a comeback for Mike Leach's team. Down 28-3 with six minutes to go before halftime. They complete the largest comeback in school history.